What's up guys, welcome back to Genshin Impact episode 6, um, and let's get right into it, um, so, let me explain a couple things what happened last time, so, last time, I kind of forgot, oh, we went up to the, uh, thing to fight the, uh, storm tour, and, it turns out that uh, he's being corrupted by some thing, like the evil things we fight. But uh, I want to explain some things I did. So um, I got him. He got. We got. Th we got. We got. Singcho. We, we got. We got Singcho here, and um, so uh, what did I do with him? Nothing. I didn't do anything with him. Uh, I actually started using the elements now. I knew about it. I just never did it. But I guess I'm going to start using it. Because I'm getting to difficult stuff now. So. Amber. I leveled Yuchan up to level. I extended him and leveled him up to level 5. Level 26 now. But um. Yeah, that's pretty much all I did, really. Leveled, extended him, and then I just got him like a couple minutes ago, actually. But and he's still the he's a sword, so he's like the uh, sword. So that's what I've been doing, just exploring and stuff, like trying to extend things, upgrade my artifacts and things like that. So. Body and the story. Time to act. If you're borrowing a book, please register it in the log. The restricted section is currently not lending any books. Oh, it's you, little cutie. 
It's so good to see you. More refreshing than a strong cup of tea in the afternoon. Clearly you're meant to be working, but you don't seem to have your heart in it at all. I mean, other than Jean, who really works that earnestly anyway? So, did you have something you needed? Or did you just come to see me? Ooh, a smooth talker. Not what I was expecting. Oh there, Lisa? What is you trying to do though, baby girl? So, Miss Librarian, got any books to recommend? Hmm, recommended books. Sadly, everything I'd personally recommend is all in the restricted section, which we're not currently lending out. What's with your ominous tone? Oh, right. Would you be interested in checking out the Devat Travel Guide? I think it would be quite helpful for you as travelers here. Ooh, sounds like it could be helpful. Do you think we could take a peek? I suppose I can try to find you a copy from the list. Isn't this Lisa's job? What does she mean, I suppose? Oh dear, that's unfortunate. Our copy is currently being borrowed. That said, it is now overdue. Come to think of it, quite a few of our books are now overdue. <sighs> I really wish people would just return their books on time. Whoa, is Paimon imagining things, or does the air in here suddenly feel a lot more electrified? <sighs> Such a pain. I'm going out to bring those unreturned books back. If you'd rather get your hands on that copy of the Tavat Travel Guide sooner, you'd better come with me. Seems really scary right now. Paimon thinks it would be best if you answer her. You really are such a considerate cutie. Let's see. First, we can go to the souvenir shop. It's called With Wind Comes Glory. So let's meet there shortly. liking this uh give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel if you want more let me know in the comments By the way, I almost have online, so I will be able to play Ma with Matthew pretty soon. So, there is something. You're here. Let's begin, shall we? Hello, Marjorie. Any exciting new items in stock? Why so surprised? 
Today is such a special day. It's only natural that I'd want a souvenir to remember it by. Oh, is that how you see it? No, I just want it to be, you know what I mean, Lisa? I want it to be a day. I'll, that's not how I see it, but that's how I want it to be. I suppose there's nothing wrong with that. At your age, these kinds of fleeting fantasies are normal. <laughs> well, if it's a souvenir you're after, you're in the right place. I'm sure you'll find something that strikes your fancy, Lisa. Or you could let your new friend pick something out for you. Make it more of an occasion. Yes, yes! Let us pick! Now, let's be honest. This is too original. And this is something she would probably like. But we're just going to get her some flowers. This pair? Soft, puffy, and very comfortable. Certain to make a little girl, well, in this case a woman, look quite adorable. After all, they're the same kind worn by toy dolls. They're practically a badge of cuteness. Bloomers? I'm sure to attract some strange looks if I dress up like a small child in public. Do you have some strange hobby you're not telling me about? Oh, Lisa, I got a lot of strange hobbies. You sure? Can't change again once you've made your mind up. I mean, if I'm telling you, do you? Oh my God! See, this is the this is this is this is why. I know this is why I can't deal with girls. Listen, it's a yes or no question. I know I'm picking, but are you going to accept it or do? I don't know what to do. I'm about to just say yes. <sighs> well, if you insist, I'll just use them as an extra pair of pajamas. Goodness, is that the time? <sighs> Marjorie, one last thing. About the legend of Vanessa. Oh, so you're a fan of the gallant lady Vanessa too? Why didn't you say so? I have all sorts of items I could recommend. For example, this lion's tooth pendant with Vanessa's name carved into it. It was once a medal awarded to a knight by the great lady herself. Hmm. Oh my goodness. I do apologize. I got so excited when you mentioned Vanessa. I didn't know that book was overdue, even though I take it with me everywhere. I can't believe I didn't put two and two together as soon as I saw you here. <laughs> here you go. Well, since you look up to Lady Vanessa so very much, please be more punctual next time. Yes, Lisa. I will be, Lisa. Why do you keep saying Lisa, 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 Lisa? You got something going on there? Let's go and find Manjoa? the next overdue book. Manjoa? I how you say it. Manjoa? I don't know. Dang, Sarah. Come on, Sarah. See, I, I didn't think he was like this. Alright, let's see how it is. Welcome to Good Hunter. Table for two? Three! Oh, <laughs> my apologies. Please sit wherever you like and call me over once you're ready to order. So we're gonna eat first and bring up the book situation later? Why, of course. The stress of work really takes the pleasure out of eating, don't you think? Work is that bad, huh? All right, sorry for the work cut there. Um, yeah, sorry for the work cut there, guys. Uh, how do you sit? I'm trying to. There we go. Sit and then talk to Lisa. Uh, 
<sighs> Why don't you order us something, cutie? I'm ever so curious to know what your tastes are. Good Hunter's signature dish. If it's what you want, I'll try anything once. You sure? Can't change again once you've made your mind up. Hmm, finished ordering? Sit here, let's dine together. Yes, I'll finish the next edition of the Adventurer's Guild. What is it? Hmm, finished ordering? I sat down already. Get me out of here. No, get me out of here. I'm sit. I just said what? Beautifully tender and cooked to perfection. No wonder it's their signature dish. It's a shame I can't have more, but a witch must watch her physique. Time is getting on. I suppose I should carry on with this ghastly thing called work. Let's have a little chat with Sarah about her library book. Yeah, I forgot about the library books. Would you like to you? order something else? No, thank you. We're quite satisfied. But, but I'm afraid I must ask you. What I'll make tonight. Okay guys, it, it's working, so um, let's see what's going on here now. Oh wait, I gotta start the mission back up. Give me a second. There we go. <sighs> this is our final call for the day. Welcome. Uh, c couples are our specialty. Let me know what you'd like and I'll wrap them up nicely for you. Ah, yes. Now, which book was it that has the line, A date without flowers is a date without romance? <laughs> Why, it just so happens that I would, my kindest cutie. Some flowers for Miss Lisa? What would you like? Missed flowers? Over there in the corner. But don't touch them with your bare hands. You'll get frostbite. You want them? You're sure? What an unusual choice. It's just that Lisa seems to use Electro quite a lot. Things could get a little bit dangerous. You sure? Can't change again once you've made your mind up. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna go with Some this flowers one. For 
Dandelions are one of our classics. And a personal favorite of Miss Flora, the shop owner. I know what you're thinking. Most flower shops don't sell dandelions. They're a nuisance to care for. Perhaps Miss Flora likes the sense of floating away to a faraway land that the dandelion evokes. Come to think of it, Miss Flora herself gives people the same impression. You sure? Can't change again once you've made your mind up. Dandelions? They actually sell dandelions? They have a refreshing scent, similar to the one Jean wears. Thank you. Okay, time to get back to business. Donna, do you know why we're here? Back to business? My business is selling flowers. <sighs> Once again, we see a total lack of respect for literature. The Pale Princess and the Six Pygmies ring a bell. Oh, uh, yes. Well, what happened was... was... Oh no, what am I gonna do? I... I lost the book. <sighs> a while back, I realized it was almost due, and I was getting ready to bring it back to the library. But I couldn't find it anywhere. I looked for days, but nothing. It's like somebody stole it. It should have been there, on my bedside table, right where I left it. Uh-oh. That Lisa does some crazy things when she gets mad. I heard that. Well, if it really was stolen, Donna's done nothing wrong. The blame lies with the book thief. And their punishment will be three, no, ten times worse than stealing my book. Oh, don't worry about that. As long as I remain librarian, not a single book will go missing for good. I put a unique elemental marker on each book. Our thief will have left a nice set of clues for us to follow. When did Lisa start taking her job so seriously? Paimon always thought she was a total slacker. Hey, sweetie. I've heard your elemental sensitivity is very strong. Why not see what you can do? Elemental sensitivity? Sensi... Huh? Use your elemental sight to look for clues! Of course they're flowers. can think about is Diluc. <sighs> Search for the book with element marks. Oh yeah, she did lose her book. And it's around the whole city. So let's just see. Let's just go around this whole area of elemental. Oh, I think I see something. Looking at the elemental traces, it does seem likely that the book was stolen. So Donna didn't do anything wrong after all. It's not from the restricted section, so it's hardly a book worth stealing. Whoever wanted this book so badly had a strange fixation indeed. The elemental traces are very faint, but I can tell that the thief took it beyond the city walls. Yeah, it's pretty obvious. You must see it too, right, cutie? Let's follow the trail and have a look where our thief was headed, shall we? <laughs> Lisa, Lisa, Lisa. Oh, you can see my foot. 
footsteps. I only can see it on the like the sand area. Don't tell me it's this little boy right here. Timmy. No, little Timmy. There's no way it could have been you. The elemental traces are strong here, but it seems our thief did not stay for long. The trail oh, keeps like... going. Let's keep looking. Man. Site, elemental site, elemental site. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Oh God, what is happening? Okay, so what are we doing? Still searching for these marks. It might be above though, who knows. Yeah, I think it's above us. Is it above me here? I'm not seeing anything. Wait, can we? Oh, yeah. I'll try to jump in. Yeah, it is, most likely. Yep, I see it. Took no damage from that. Okay, that's pretty good. Hmm, it's further than I thought. Quite the intrepid explorer, our little thief. Maybe we frighten the turtle back inside his Wait, did he just do a backflip? Hold up. Body and mind. I swear I saw him do a backflip. It must have not been a backflip. I just have been imagining it. I'm about to say, did this man just do a backflip, bro? Like, dang. Time to act. What's that? Oh, like a chest.
must be nearby. Using elemental sight, you can even detect magic. Follow the flow of magic to find the book. What do you mean? You wanna tell me? Oh, that's what you mean. Like this. Is it? Isn't it? Okay. So this way. This way. Okay. Then you gotta break the rock or something? The thief lives inside ruins? The Mondstadt people do have some strange quirks. Please do not jump to such a preposterous conclusion about the living habits of Mondstadt's residents. This seems far more likely to be the work of some none too friendly troublemakers. Stealing books is hardly the Hilly Churl style. All they would use books for is to keep their campfire going anyway. This is more likely to be the Abyss Order's doing. They do seem to have a way of slipping in and out of places like ghosts, after all. Also, there's an elemental seal at the entrance. It looks like the result of an Abyss Mage's magic. A seal? How are we gonna break it? Is this gonna turn into another huge ordeal? <laughs> Not to worry. If you think a little magic can keep me out, think again. Why is that? That's why, okay. I see Come Lisa. On. I see Lisa, okay. Whoa! So this is what Lisa's like when she's hard at work. <laughs> oh, we can, alright. got it doesn't we, we don't have to have a listening I was gonna say like do we actually have to have some sort of element but that's good we don't it's oh so much bigger in here than Paimon yeah, let me also show you guys something so uh, do we really have to go all the way inside if you guys if didn't you know this a book, you have to return it there will be no exceptions um if you guys didn't know this, I put uh, Noel, I put Noel, and then I put Chan Yu on an expedition, which is a side mission. It's not, it's for to get your level up, so that's what I did. So we can't see them until 20 hours. That's, I put it on like a couple hours ago. So we can eventually be them like in a like 39 minutes that's what it's last told me so we can get them back 39 minutes from now or whenever so we got this lisa i wish i had my lisa instead of this lisa because oh i see what this going on you this is gonna push me this way isn't it yes it is this is gonna push me up, and that's gonna kill me if I don't go over it. Okay, which I'll make it. It's gonna push me up. Yes. How do you? Oh, I made it. Sometimes I hate this because it's just so weird. And this is gonna be. Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. Okay. I don't even know if you can get hit by it, I'm just scared. All right. 
great. Oh, wait. Oh, we gotta hit this with something? What do we gotta do? Oh, uh, this way? Oh god, my bad, guys. I just snatched my controller out of my... Oh, let's go. Co op unlocked. Yay, I got online, baby. Let's go. <laughs> um, electric. Okay. Alright, I see. I see. I see. Wait, so what do we need? What? You gotta be fudging kidding me. No, you're joking, right? So if you guys wonder why did she sound like a boy, it wasn't her, it was uh, uh, the pigeon. I mean the, the raven? Raven, right? Yeah, I think it was, it was the raven. I think that's what it's called, but that's the raven, it isn't her, trust me. At first I thought it was her too, but it's just the raven. Every time you do that attack, you can clearly hear that it's the, it's the um, raven. You're in for a little shock. Yes, you guys see it. I'm level 35. Uh, let's just say I got a ascend, and I was able to upgrade. So that's something that was good. You guys are kidding me, right? <laughs> I almost didn't live that final trial. Alright, my bad. Sorry for that, guys. I'm I'm sorry. Ooh, 
interest in finding out where you little rascals hide yourselves away, but I do want my book back. Tell me, how is it that you have the time to conceal your stronghold and apply a magic seal, but not to sign out a library book in the proper manner? You have no respect whatsoever for other people's work. You... you just want... the book? I was unaware that anyone in Mondstadt was concerned with unearthing the secret hidden inside this book. Who... who are you? The librarian, although I believe that should be quite clear already. Return the book. This is an ultimatum. <laughs> Since you insist on concealing your identity, I have all the less reason to give you that book. After all, it contains the secret. Huh? Wh wh what are you doing? Such concentrated elemental power! P please don't! Why did they just show that? Hmm. <laughs> Naughty boys who don't do what they're told need a little punishment to keep them in line. <sighs> this is why I call it troublesome work. So... She isn't scary, honestly. <laughs> Can't lie. We'll just need to find the book ourselves. It should be around here somewhere. No, see, watch we don't even watch this. I mean, watch we don't even get this. Literally what? Oh. Okay, there. Imagine we did that on the elevator. <laughs> go and chase. It's the Pale Princess and the Six Pygmies. Paimon remembers that name. Is this the one you were looking for? That's the one. It's a good thing it isn't damaged. Otherwise... Otherwise what? Are you telling me you have even more crazy punishments up your sleeve? <laughs> I would have probably have needed to dish out a little taste of one of my potions in that case. Uh... Then again, as I said, it isn't from the restricted section, which is the only reason I would let the average citizen borrow it in the first place. And it doesn't appear to have any abnormal elemental properties, save for the markings I put on it. Yeah! It seems like just an average storybook. As far as my duties as a librarian go, my troublesome work is finished. Since this book has piqued your interest, why don't I let you borrow it? There's no time limit for you. I will register you as custodian rather than borrower. This is an exclusive privilege reserved for trusted citizens only. Exclusive privilege? Why does Paimon feel this is just your sneaky way of offloading your troublesome work onto someone? Excuse me, are you in some way dissatisfied with my work? Good. You're amenable to reason, then. <sighs> I do wish I could keep you by my side as my personal assistant. My work here is done. I'm going back. 
Don't forget to register at the library when you have a spare moment. Okay. So, let me get all this stuff. I guess we're done with that, right? Yeah, let's use the Let the show now. begin! Okay, so here we go. Oh, actually, no, that's, that's just fast travel. I ain't about to do all that now. I need to really get that thing there, and I don't know how to. I'm gonna just figure that out now. So that's what I'm about to do right now, guys. So give me a second, let me get here. Exactly show where. Uh. <laughs> I mean, it is higher because it's still up. So, up here, perhaps. <clears throat> Let's take a okay. safe down here and then just crawl up like this. Like, <clears throat> it must be right, it must be up here if it's uh, taking this long. Don't you think? Oh, stay right there. Yes, up here, let's go. Okay, that's a 
took quite a while to figure that out. So let's go over here and some up. Okay, so, um, I'm gonna end it right here, y'all. I know this wasn't really a long video like on my other ones, but, um, if you guys enjoyed, give it a nice thumbs up. If you guys want to see more, let me know in the comment below. Also, subscribe if you want to see me play more games. Let me know what games you guys want to see me play. And, um, that's it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, peace. Tell me that you love me, even if it's fake